Crazy God story. If you don't think that God is still doing the things today that he did in the book of Acts through regular everyday followers of Jesus, check this out. A while back, I was driving down the highway in Corpus Christi, Texas, and there was a truck broke down on the side of the road with a flat tire, so I stopped to help. The guy had a spare but no tools, so I changed it for him. Now, I tried to talk to him about Jesus, but he was really frustrated and didn't want to have that conversation, so on one of my business cards, I wrote down the name, address, and phone number of a church that I like, Calvary Chapel, and I gave it to him. I went on my way and I didn't think anything else of it. And then like a month later, I got a phone call from a guy named Ron that went to that church. He called me up. He was like, hey, the next time you're in Corpus, I want to buy you a cup of coffee and talk to you about the guy that had the flat tire that you stopped to help. He let me know that guy had been a drug enforcer for a living, not a drug dealer, but a drug enforcer. He was the person that made sure that drug dealers got paid or that bad things happened. He had been wanting to get out of that life altogether. And the night before I stopped, he had had a dream where God told him, if you don't get out of this life, your life is going to be over. And the next day, he was shocked that the only person that stopped to help him tried to talk to him about Jesus. So he went to the church I suggested where he met Ron, heard the gospel, and gave his life to Jesus. Now he reaches other people with the gospel and gets them out of life he used to be. And he went from being a dope dealer to a hope dealer. I didn't do anything special. I just tried to talk to somebody about Jesus and God included me in something amazing he was doing. And he'll do the same with anybody who lives by faith and follows Jesus.